everybody! How are you? Today, we are not going to cook some special dish. I'm going to show you how to cut chicken. How do you buy chicken? You buy that you know, chicken already pre-cut, chicken wing, chicken breast, but expensive. So in my case, I usually buy whole chicken. Whole chicken bring home, I cut into pieces. Each part of a chicken tastes different, so that we use for different recipes. In Korea, chicken leg is most important. So the chef, the cook, decide who is going to have this chicken leg. In America, Canada, I found out chicken breast is the most important part. In your country, which part of chicken is considered most best part? I like to know. <laughs> I still like chicken leg because chicken leg is tasty. I'm going to show you how to cut the whole chicken into pieces so that you can make some different recipes. So let's start. It's an organic chicken. I bought this. Quite expensive, but you don't have to buy the organic chicken. You will see the kind of really watery, wet, and slimy. I like to wash this really thoroughly. Just take a shower. All the remove the all the kind of slippery thing until it's not slippery. Wash. Our chicken is clean. Next, more serious job. So cutting. Put the chicken on the cutting board like this. My grandmother's method, when she makes dakbokkumtang or things like that, she just cut it up, you know, and then uh, chunks of chicken, and then she used this. She just uh, pick up from the yard, you know, one chicken. When she has VIP, VIP is uh, her son-in-law or, you know, son. That's a big day. And then she just, uh, she's uh, like a small lady, just uh, my size. And she just uh, took it and one, you know, chicken, and she, twist the head until the chicken died. Always I remember my father's side, the grandmother, she is a very tough lady. But today I'm going to show you how to cut section by section, very easy way. And then you can keep in the freezer or refrigerator, and then you can cook all different recipes. Are you ready to cut together? Just use your knife. And then just press this with your both hands like this. Here there is a fat line. So cut it. Just following this very easily. And the other side too. Press like this, so the bone, leg bone is coming up. So you can cut along this. So same thing, there's a line. Like this. Wing also. See here is there's also joint. You will see that bones here. Here too. Cut it. So here is a joint. Here. Oh, lots of fat. Remove the tip. I like to cut the chicken breast here. And chicken breast, you see, there's also a you know, fat line this here. And the other part, same. So very easily. I use in you know, kitchen sears. Easily you can cut it up. Along the line, the fat line. Here too. Yeah, 
So hard bones here so we can break. And this part in the middle, you will see this like a V, V shape. You can see this, and then like this. And easily you can cut like that. So here, this, that part, I like to trim. So now, we have some interesting part, the chicken backbone. Backbone, but I'm looking for some oyster. It's very tasty, tasty part. One chicken has only two. Let's find the oyster. This meat is so tender and delicious. So cut it up. Here, can okay, that? So here, this part, very tasty. Now, chicken backbone we have. Chicken backbone you can use for the stock or just eat. And then especially when you fry this, it's nice. Between the bones, there are lots of meat also. And cut like this. Is it familiar? This is a, when I visited Korea, I bought this. I bought the two, so two knives. I was going to make a new intro, like a tap, 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 tap. And I use this knife like this. And then I was going to use two knives, but I changed my mind. I gave it to the other one, to my mom. But my mom had to pay me one dollar because in Korea, we never use knife as a gift. It can bring some bad karma. I told my mom, just buy this one, buy this knife for one dollar. So she had to pay one dollar. Okay, this is not a gift. I sold this to you. So now I'm going to cook my two oysters. Oyster is usually for VIP or VVIP. <laughs> Who can be my VVIP? That's you. But later I'm going to eat on behalf of you. <laughs> and this is sesame oil. And salt. and black pepper Mmm, smell good Vinegar and soy sauce Just a little One drop And the rest So this like that Done. Wow, it looks so good. There we go. More sesame oil. This is really fun because while I'm doing this, my video, and I still can eat something. When you cut up whole chicken, always eat this. So don't forget this oyster. So tender. Tender and juicy and just a little bit chewy. Awesome. Best of the best part of chicken. If you don't cook just right now, you have to freeze it. All this. All chicken legs and chicken wings, including all these backbones cut up into pieces. So you can make this chicken, Korean fried chicken. 
And also, you know, Korean dak bokkum tang, spicy braised chicken, and all kind of stuff you can make this. This is chicken breast. Today, I showed you how to cut up this chicken, whole chicken. So I hope it's very helpful for you. And pick up the, some chicken, whole chicken, and sometimes on sale, you can make the many, many different recipes with this. Next time, I'm going to make something delicious things with this. I have so many recipes that I have not shared yet, but which one first I need to think about. Enjoy watching my video. See you next time. Bye.